headed to Trader Joe's now, and I have just been enjoying this 15 mile road trip from the park, looking at serious mansions. <laughs> The address here for Trader Joe's is Nashville. So, while I'm here, I might as well take a look, right? Anyways, I saw in somebody's vehicle a Trader Joe's bag when I was over at the garden center. And I was like, hmm, I wonder if there's a Trader Joe's close by. So, I remember back in the day, I loved going there, get some sushi, a sandwich, a couple salads, some lunch meat and cheese, and all kinds of specialty fun little goodies that would last me a week or two. Well, now that I'm heading out... In 1,000 feet, turn left. So I thought, you know what, it'll be fun to have a couple specialties to get on down the road instead of my usual Walmart. So hope you'll join me. Linda here, Serene and Simple Life. There it is, Trader Joe's. Macy's on up the way. Across the street is Men's Warehouse. I don't know, nothing serene and simple about this area, but I'm gonna enjoy. I haven't been in Trader Joe's, I don't know, in a year or two. So this should be fun. Fancy apartments over there. Oh, probably what, what would you guess? Maybe I'd say eh, Nashville, $1,500 to $1,800 a month. Sure. You can walk everywhere. You can walk to Trader Joe's. And I just finished in there $67.55. So let me show you what I got. Gotta take everything out of the bag and then I'll put it back in. Yep. Everything from Trader Joe's is healthy, right? Probably not. Now I do this kind of um, when I'm about to travel, you know, so I can eat on the road and save money and I probably bought too much cold stuff but you know you'll have that I'll just eat it the next couple days this is good for on the road organic applesauce I hear these don't need to be refrigerated and I got a salad for tomorrow during the day I think I'll save that till tomorrow. Yum. And I got a bag of spring mix. I have some dressing already, some oil and vinegar type. I got some healthy muffins. Sure. We've got pears, Bartlett, and I love these honey crisp. Look how little. I don't know, they were only two something, I think. So that'll do me for a little while. In the summertime, I won't be able to do that because they'll get too uh, ripe too quickly. Fig bites. And I bought more bag things just because I won't open them all at once and they'll be a nice treat. I think a half a sandwich will be my dinner tonight. So we've got meals for the next few days. Bought some turkey. I hear you don't always have to refrigerate turkey. Yep, peanut butter puffins to snack on, granola, love granola. Haven't bought this in a while, almond milk. I don't think you have to refrigerate that. I'm not 100% certain on any of this. My stomach will let me know. These were fun, 75 cents. Got one more down here. What is this one? Yeah, orange mango. So that's about it, guys. Some cereals, sandwich, salad, salad, turkey, cheese, and then three bags of snackers, breakfast, pita to put my salad in, something different. Those were only $1.49, I debated. And two bags of fruit. So there you have it, $67. I don't have to take too much out of the 
I'll take these out of the boxes. And uh, I don't know that I'll do that right now. I'll just leave them in these nice paper bags. I love these bags. That's about it for now. Gonna head on down the road in the morning and I'll let you know when I get to my first. My first city destination is Greenville. And that's about 600 miles away. So I'll do that in about three days. Alrighty. We will catch you on down the road. Blessings in your day and joy in the journey. It's a Trader Joe's haul. Haven't done that in a year or two. Woohoo! So here's the little wrap up. There's the pitas, the muffins. I've got all the cold stuff tucked in this bag here. This is filled to the brim. Almonds, my little <laughs> swimmers. Yeah, like they're healthy, right? Okay, and uh, the milk over here in the corner. This was kind of getting low, so I was pretty in good shape here. There's my fig bites, a couple drinks down below that I just bought. Oh, the fruit is tucked back in here underneath the muffins. Got two bags of fruit. For those of you who think that all as I eat is junk food, <laughs> proving you wrong right now. And there's for dinner. And then over here, folded up the bags. I'll put these in the back. I don't know how long I'll keep them. But they do make good something or other, right? Especially when I was in sticks and bricks. Or I can reuse them at a store. And then this is what I'm going to throw away. I figured I should do that right now, not take it with me. And here's the snacks, which I will open these. I don't know, one or two at a time. Maybe some cereal tonight with my almond milk for a snack. I've already got pretzels open, so it'll be a while before I open these guys. But it's going to be a while before I go back to Trader Joe's, too. So I went a little overboard, but it was fun to buy some different snacks. And instead of just the old Walmart everything. So that was really cool. I enjoyed it. In the past, I would buy a lot of, I don't know, not a lot, but four or five frozen meals. And, oh, I looked at buying some mushrooms. I looked at buying uh, some raw cauliflower, some hummus, uh, some snap peas. But then I said, you know what? I'm getting carried away here and things are going to go bad before I uh, get them eaten. So since I don't have my cooler with me, I don't know. That was a decision on a whim, you know, that I didn't want to carry it with me. So, and I'm thinking about selling it. I'm not sure yet, but it's awfully big. So anyways, on down the road. Blessings in your day and joy in the journey. Later. So I couldn't resist taking advantage of my discount while I still have it. I'm going to try this one you mix with water rather than the capsules because they're out of the capsules yes can't go in here without getting one of these oh, this is something fun find your happy place after the rain I don't know it's only like six dollars <laughs> made in Wyoming so that's kind of fun renew your spirit yeah rejuvenate and then I'm going to continue taking these. I don't know if they're doing any good or not. And this says new, and I'm just about out of blush. How pretty is that? So that's called Rose Balm, for those of you who would like to know. And down here, just a few randoms. This to go with my flax chips that I got at Trader Joe's. And yeah, I'm out of bowls, and I keep thinking I'm not going to buy bowls, and then I do. And then I love grabbing these instead of washing a fork or a spoon. Now that's really lazy, isn't it? <laughs> out of paper towels. Restocking just a little bit here on the staples. But I am determined to eat up what I have. But I am getting low on vegetables, and I these are good. Uh, I haven't had these in a while. 
got someone unhappy here in the store. I'm gonna buy the little better chicken breast. I looked at the ingredients and I don't know. I like that this says no preservatives and 98% uh, fat free. And it also says, yeah, with no, uh, whatever, I can't read that right now. And then, I don't know, a couple different flavors of tuna to mix with the same old, same old that I have. Lima beans, staple, two of those. And that will about do her. Alrighty. This was your one more thing for the day. I think I'm done here. I'm gonna go check out. Alrighty, later. How pretty. Now I'm getting into two more things. There's my uh, landing zone for the night. Bunch of parking spaces here. They'll probably remain empty, just the way I like it. There's culvers across the way. And I don't know, some people park way on the other side, I think, but I was here the other night and it felt right. And look at this, guys. I just decided to drop it right here so you could uh, see where I'm at from a distance. $72, oh my gosh, after my discount. I had $4.51 discount. And yeah, I'm on a leave of absence right now in case I decide to go back. <laughs> we'll just leave it at that. And I, the only other thing I picked up was some butter because I have pancake mix and I like butter on crackers. I like buttered bread. Not sure why I bought that plastic silverware. I know that's a waste and it's not good for the environment and all that good stuff. But I got to thinking about it. It's like it's, I'm having a picnic and that's fun to me because I have this big old fork that's heavy and I forgot to get a smaller fork. I could buy one, but it just would be so dang cheap. So, yep, this is it. $72 later. I guess it was like the the fiber stuff and these were like 10 bucks and the blush was 8. I don't know. This was like 6. Sure does add up. Like my daddy used to say, easy come, easy go. Okay. Hope you enjoyed my Trader Joe haul. And then had to go into Walmart. Gave me something to do for a little while. And I'm looking forward to getting on down the road. Potentially six months of travels. Alrighty. Later.